Namaste. In times of doubt, fear, and even danger, chanting can throw them away. Let me share with you a story in one of my meditations, and that one was not as ideal, because not all meditations are beautiful. Yeah. I was being chased by bad elements, and I wanted to resurface already because I cannot sustain it. Yeah. I was afraid, yeah. and then I was approached by a young boy, yeah, a deva, a divine personality, and he held my hands. All right, chant this with me, he mentioned. So he pulled me into a sitting position. Yeah, all right, chant this with me. Sandiram. That's the mantra he gave me. Sandiram. And I kept chanting it, chanting it, while we were holding hands. And the bad elements just passed through us. And they didn't even notice and see we were there sitting. Yeah? And the vibration got even stronger that I started to hear the room, my brain, you know, filled with the mantra or the vibration. Um, while that is playing, you know, we were chanting the Sandiram. And like the, the mantra Sandiram you know, produces the vibration of the Om. And he told me, this mantra is one of the six ways to become invisible. All right. He shared with me actually another two, the Om and the Soham. Yeah. Then, yeah. Um, but that's, that's a mantra given to me. I truly believe that yeah, each and every one of us yeah, has specific yeah, mantra. Yeah. And I didn't know the meaning of the Sandiram. Um, then I... Yeah, I told this story to a friend of mine, a colleague of mine, and she mentioned Sandiram actually means a place close to us, like our homes. Yeah. So that's, that's my mantra. Yeah. You might have a different mantra, yeah, but a general mantra we can practice, all of us, yeah, is the Om. The Om is the universal sound. It's the source of all that is created. The universe is made up or is, uh, come from this vibrational Om. Yeah, so when you say it, take a nourishing breath in, and using a low vibrational melodious frequency, oh, oh. All right, saying it quietly. Yeah, but rich. We did distribute the sound yeah, from the front of the mouth when we say the O, oh, oh, and we draw the sound to the back of the mouth. And as we touch the lips, they vibrate. We also hum the vocal cords, and that goes to the brain. Om. Oh. Yes. Yeah, so the heaviness we carry, yeah, well, I think it's brought about by too much of ten tension. And then when we allow yeah, our voice and our vibration yeah, to decompress and release the tension away from the body, then our heaviness goes too.